All right, well, Aqua is now absurdly powerful. <laughs> and we aren't even at the end of the game yet. We still have a couple more worlds to do. We're off to deep space today, everybody. Combat level six, here we go. No messing around this time, we just go straight to the world title. Deep space. Chronologically, Aqua goes to this world in between Terra and Ventus going to it. No, there is not. Eliminate all the unversed. With pleasure. Actually, I don't remember what my command deck is like. We just have a bunch of random commands that I was leveling up. Wonderful. Ooh, yeah. Well, oh, that's right, we got Magic Hour. This looks cool. And it does a lot of damage, too. Oh, boy, Sky Climber. <laughs> the best command style. Well, we still kick butt. <laughs> and our Kuriga levels up. That's unrelated to the cutscene. It just happened to coincide. This looks like the Wayfinders, but how did it get here? <laughs> Tell me, where did you get that? <laughs> Come out, you little trog! <laughs> Wait! You there. Has Experiment 626 passed through this area? I don't understand. Experiment what? Don't be dense. Dr. Jumbo Jukiba's genetic abomination. 626. Six. Small, blue, vicious. Him? But he didn't look vicious. Ah, so you have seen him. Yes, he's in the ventilation system. Blast, he got away again. Hold it right there. Why don't I know you? What section are you from? <laughs> he doesn't even realize that she's a stowaway. He's just like, you're a weird looking alien. Um, I'm... Trying to stow away, are we? No, yeah, never mind. I said stay close. She's like, okay. Dane, this guy is big. What is the meaning of this... Captain Gantu, did I not order you to apprehend the fugitives immediately? Yes, and I will have them in custody soon. They'd be locked up already if those wretched monsters were just... I mean, if I hadn't uncovered this potential stowaway. I wasn't trying to sneak on board. My name is Aqua. And those monsters? I followed them here. Please, I can handle this threat. Just give me a chance. Let me show you. The weapon I carry is the only one that can stop them. Our weapons are of no use against them? Is this true? Well, we haven't explored all our options. Nor do we have time to. We are fortunate you are here, Aqua. Your assistance would be most welcome. But Grand Councilwoman, you can't honestly believe what this stowaway says. I think you'll find I can. We have a crisis. Jumba and 626 remain at large, and these monsters are obstructing attempts to apprehend them. Or did I mishear your latest excuse as to why you've again failed to carry out your duties, Captain? Yikes. Will you help us? Of course. Defeating them is my job. It's what I do best, ma'am. 
Then might I make one other request? Should you happen upon our fugitives, please do whatever you can to apprehend them intact. Where's Tara? You want me he to was one of the fugitives. Jumba and experiment 626? But you can't just... That's my job! <laughs> you had your chance, Captain Gundu. Now you will stand down and await orders. <laughs> we will monitor the location of the monsters and keep you apprised. Thank you for your help, Aqua. Grand Councilwoman of is <laughs> no nonsense. I appreciate that. Experiment 626 was carrying a wayfinder. I'd note that shape anywhere. Are Tara and Ben here too? Well, Tara broke out a dangerous prisoner just because he's like, I am innocent. Okay, I believe you. And then Ventus, uh, I don't think Ven has arrived here. Because in Ven's story, uh, it ended with uh, Stitch escaping and blasting off into hyperspace, which is what he does in the movie. So I'm pretty sure Ven hasn't arrived here yet. All right, what can we buy from the store? We can buy a lot of stuff. I'm not sure if I want to buy a lot of stuff, though. Oh boy, Cure Boost. Hooray. What else do we have that we can level up? Oh, Thunder Surge. I do love me some Thunder Surge. Uh, wow, that is a lot of Fyras. That is a lot of Fyras. Okay. Well, I know what I'm buying from the shop. I'm buying some Fires to go along with it so we can meld those into Fyragas. And then get some more triple Fyragas. And because we're in a late game world, they should level up remarkably quickly. This is the best. Thanks, Grand Councilwoman. Don't be a stranger. A balloon letter, yay. This isn't the place I was asked to investigate. Well, but there might be treasure over there, Aqua. You know how I love treasure. Okay, so this way is blocked off. This giant hallway. Depending on who you are, some of the doorways will just be off limits. Dang, Magnet Spiral is actually pretty good for Aqua. <laughs> Magic Hour is fun to use as well. Even though it's one of those, uh, <laughs> two slot commands. And of course, Fire Wheel is still hilarious. <laughs> Hilariously broken, as always. Oh, look, Blade Charge! <laughs> you can order just. Fire wheel these guys repeatedly with our cartwheel, and then we get a giant magic blade to destroy everything. It's great. <laughs> I don't know why people hate Birth by Suits combat. I think it's pretty awesome. Granted, it's not as good as Kingdom Hearts 2's, but people act like it's really terrible, and it's not. It's fun. Oh look, our Fire and Thunder Surge uh, leveled up. How wonderful. Fire, fire, a hungry crystal. Fire Aga with HP prize plus. We'll start leveling up another fire. Actually, now that I can think about it, what abilities do we have? So we've got free treasure magnets. We have one HP prize plus. Two link prize. Okay, okay, we got some good ones. We've kind of got the important one. Oh no, we need more attack hastes. That's for sure. We also need another finish boost. Oh my god, okay, hang on, we need Leaf Bracer. 100% we need Leaf Bracer. I can't believe we don't have it already. I thought that was like the first thing I created, but no. Okay. Then in that case, we're going to have a change of plans. I should have used a Pulsing Crystal on that one to get Leaf Bracer, but uh, no. I was stupid and I used a Hungry Crystal instead. That's fine. I'm going to level up the Fire and the Fire Rust so we can meld those together and get Leaf Bracer. Oh, also, there's the Zack D-Link that we need to level up now. Oh, hey, look! A D-Link flower already. Beautiful. Now we can D-Link him again. Oh, 
Okay, I actually don't want that second level up, but it doesn't matter. All right, we got the second level up regardless. The reason for that is we never actually got to use his first finisher. Uh, hero's uh, entrance. And we need to use that finisher in order to add it to our uh, game logs book. Or our record book, I guess. Activate the transporter? Sure! Well, yeah, th see, this transporter is broken when Ventus uh, arrives. Or it's not working properly. But it is for Terra and Aqua. Maybe Aqua's gonna break it. She's like, oh my gosh, I hate Gantu so much! <laughs> Whoops. Here we are. Yeah, we haven't been here since uh, Terra was here with Jumba. Oh, how wonderful. We get a map. And here we are. Doopy 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 doop. Hey, Stitch. I guess he doesn't get the name Stitch until he meets Lilo, which takes place after this game. Look out! You must be Experiment 626. I have orders to take you in. Sora! What? I think you and I need to talk. First things first. Alright, here we go. More enemies. Team up with Experiment 626 and defeat the Unversed. I don't think I need to team up with him, dude. Aqua's an absolute beast at this point. Look at that. She just destroyed it all by herself. Flame Salvo is also almost max level now. It's great. Accidentally hit that guy in the front too many times. Well, he's dead anyways. <laughs> we get a maximum HP increase. <laughs> well, how nice. Thanks. I owe you. What is it you're looking for? Huh? Wait! I just need to ask you! I don't know how she was able to understand Stitch was saying Terra there, but, uh, alright. <laughs> Cause we won't question it. Or well, more importantly, there should be treasure in this room. And a bounding crystal, how nice. Going up. I can't believe we still- wait, okay, hang on. Do we have air slide? And I just never equipped it? No, we don't have air slide yet. Man, Aqua gets air slide so late, and you can't even meld it. <laughs> Blitz. Oh, great. All right. We're temporarily equipping a sliding dash. Because this is one of those rooms where, because we don't have air dash, we're going to need to uh, use this. I love sequence breaking. Teleport! Use teleport to quickly get behind an enemy. Lock onto your foe and press square just before it attacks. Teleporting really pays off if your opponent is vulnerable from behind. However, it also can screw you over if you want to use a guard command and instead it's like, you want to teleport? Okie dokie. I mean, we're going to equip it anyways because, hey, I can show it off, but... 
when we're doing the really tough end game fights, I will not be using teleport. Because it's kind of bad. What? Thanks for grabbing on, Aqua. Aqua! Grab on to the moving platforms, please. We can always EXP grind by walking in circles while we're waiting for the platform to go up. Because that's what we need, more EXP. And I'm not even taking advantage of EXP chance. Or the Mickey Mouse D-Link. <laughs> if you use those two combined, oh man, you get you literally are going to get quadruple the experience. Nothing? That's not nothing. A sticker. The Dale sticker. How come Chip and Dale get to be in every single picture book? Nothing in there. How about down here? There we go. Uh, oh, so close, Aquas. Oh, sweetie. Alright. Mig potion. That was a close one. No! Arg! Sometimes if you jump when you're walking off an edge, they're just like, uh, no, not doing it. Like, there! I, I literally pushed the button before she had finished walking off a cliff. Still, it's like, nope, you don't get that. So I think we already did everything up here. I gotta double check. Okay, so that's that's the teleport one. <sighs> okay, I think we got everything in here. I probably missed like one chest and we'll have to go back for it. Whatever, maybe we'll have air dash by, or air slide by then. All right, I wanna get hero's entrance. Here we go. Enough. Boom. Now we can switch back over to the much better hero's pride. And now comes the most obnoxious part of Deep Space as Aqua. Oh boy, yeah, so we have to get our Keyblade armor on and go outside in our Keyblade old person. <laughs> Mo motor vehicle. Eliminate all of the unburst. This is not much fun because we have no commands. No, we've got to use X and uh, triangle. Oh yeah, um, I apparently don't have full HP. That's gonna suck. So we just gotta basically speed around and beat up the unburst. Alright, well I guess that was a lot easier than I remember. Still not very fun though. But there we go. And finally we get air slide. Jeez Louise, that was wait that took way too long. Got it. It's so important we save the make-believe Wayfinder. This must be the Wayfinder that 626 was carrying around. Dr. Jumba and Experiment 626 have been sighted. 
Took us long enough. They're still in the ship. Don't we have like security cameras everywhere? Also, Jumba is fat. Like, how do we not see him? This is ridiculous. At that time, the two of them were wandering around the launch deck. Would you see that they're secured? Is experiment 626 really that dangerous of a creature? We must assume so. All right, then. I'll head over there now. Okie dokie. And oh boy, our fire got to max level. How wonderful. Now we can equip something else. Like, say, fire. <laughs> totally worth it. We're just going out. Having a fantastic day. Oh, ho ho, what do you think you're doing here? Don't you realize who you're up against? Aqua and her cartwheels of death? You really should have picked a better opponent. <laughs> Look! Oh boy, we unlocked Magic Pulse number four! I can't even remember the last time I did a normal finisher because it's just so easy to enter Blade Charge Command Style, which is just way better! <laughs> but Magic Pulse number four, I've been waiting for that one. Boom, 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 boom. Hey, Magnet Spiral reaches maximum level. Oh, that's just great. We can equip another fire. And also go to our finish commands. Magic Pulse number four. <laughs> nah, -uh. nah, -uh. I don't think so. Now we have Avada Kedavra. <laughs> it's not instant death, but this allows us to use a bunch of the magic pulses all at once, which is pretty great. I think we will, for the time being, though, go back to Obliviate. Ooh, actually. Let's go back to Stupefy and... Oh, uh, no. Go back to Obliviate. So we gotta take some more steps. Plus, it's not like we use the traditional finishers anyways, right? <laughs> oh, look, our fire reached maximum level. Right, well, after we did that completely pointless minigame of beating the Unversed, which literally accomplished nothing, now we can go right back there and ignore them and just go to the other side of the airship. What? What do you mean it wasn't you weren't told to go there? Yes, you were! Were we supposed to take the teleporter? Doesn't matter. Kill everybody again. Oh my gosh, I literally just had to go right through this area. Right next to the, uh, Grand Councilwoman. Okay. <sighs> well, I feel sheepish. <laughs> That's okay, though. Ooh, Fire Surge. It's no Thunder Surge, but I'll take it. And now we get to take advantage of the zero point gravity. No, I don't want to use Sky... Oh, great. Magic Hour takes me into the Sky Climber command style. Thanks. I hate it. You can't jump. You can't dodge. Sky Climbers sucks. Seriously, why can I not move down? Like, whatever elevation you're at, you're just stuck at that elevation. Unless you can attack an enemy that's in a different... Really? And I can't even exit it because I can't attack enemies fast enough to reach the freaking finisher. And because of the zero gravity, anytime I attack them, they get launched super high up into the air. This is awful. Well, 
Okay, get out of that command style. Good lord. One fan. Uh, I forgot to equip air slide. That was a whoopsie. Oh, yay. Fire and fire hour have reached their maximum potential. Fire, fire, uh, pulsing crystal. Leaf bracer, fireaga. Hooray. There we go. Oh, hey, Flame Salvo reached max level, too. Now that is nice. Oh, man. Aqua, your air slide is so bad. I mean, everybody. Look at that. She barely gets any distance at all. Once it's max level, we'll change that, but still, it's ridiculous. Obliviate! Sesame Prism Rain! That's what I was waiting for. So that's an Aqua exclusive shot lock and one of her main shot locks. Prism Rain, watch a salvo of rainbow colored orbs. It's pretty powerful and it looks very pretty. Hey, that's just like Aqua herself. <laughs> Don't you want to turn off the gravity again and go into Sky Climber Command style? I know you do. No, I don't. Nope. That is wrong. Grab that sticker in the middle of the room, the UFO sticker. Hey, when there's zero gravity around, Aqua actually can air dash a decent amount just because she floats to the ground really slowly. It's a miracle. Bye-bye. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot I even had homing slide equipped. Here we go. I believe this is boss time. It's time to give up. Then I will fix abnormality. And ridiculous behavior stops. Hold it right there. Huh? Dr. Jumba. Experiment 626. I've been authorized to take you into custody. So it really does belong to you. But where have you seen that shape? His copy he made of good luck charm that boy Terra showed to him. Terra said friend gave him charm, was very protective of it. He really said that to you? Yes. Then you're still alright, Terra. You're still trusting now, villains, though. Because of Terra and his little Bobo, my genius creation is hesitating in his genetically programmed destructive instincts. So look at him. Oh? What are you doing? Our orders are to capture them alive. I've decided to take a new approach. All right, you two. Any last words before I blast you into a million pieces? La la, Pantuzzi! I'm just Big Bone! <laughs> sure, Gantu. Freeze! <laughs> Gantu is fast because he's huge. Stop it! I warned you, stay out of it! I guess we have to do this the hard way. Alright, here we go! Boss of Big Deep Space, we finally get to put a stop to Gantu. When Experiment 626 starts hopping, throw him at the enemy! Can't do, you fool. <laughs> Goodbye. Blurb. <laughs> Goodbye, Gantu. Kill Gantu just by cartwheeling into him over and over again. I love Fire Wheel. <laughs> this is so unfair. What the heck? I'm not done with you yet. Enough. 
I observed everything on the monitor. I, I can explain. You've been of great service, Aqua. Thank you. <sighs> Captain Gantu, escort 626 to the asteroid to which he's been banished. When you return, you're back on patrol. Not patrol. <laughs> well, then that, you shouldn't be trying to kill people who you don't have authorization to kill. <laughs> Please, your highness. Would you consider sparing experiment 626? Spare him? He's an extremely dangerous creature. I cannot release such a menace. But it seems to me he's at least trying to make friends. And dangerous or not, I really believe he can succeed. Very well, Aqua. If he behaves himself, I will consider shortening his exit. Thank you, ma'am. Well, that was easier than in the movie. <laughs> the charm you made do you think maybe my circle of friends could become part of yours nope my name is Aqua. stitch is being picky about his friends my friends are tara and ventus dang he was able to pronounce aqua's name kind of accurately good job stitch I did not need your help against Gantu, but I'm also ridiculously overleveled and playing an overpowered character with overpowered abilities. <laughs> Still fun, though. We forged the dealing of Experiment 626, yes! And we get the Hyperdrive Keyblade, double yes! Oh, uh, yes! I love the 626 D-Link! <laughs> and we get the command board for Deep Space. We already had it in the Mirage Arena, though. Don't need it again. And we get Neverland. Yeah, yeah, that's also great. <laughs> I do love me some Neverland, but uh, we did not even come close to getting all of the uh, treasures here, so... Let's go back to the control room. Alright, doop 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 doop. Uh, you know what? Let's equip Flame Solo, because I never actually fired that off. The ship hub. Again, we need to fire off each shot lock at least one time in order to add those to our logbook. Oh look! We already get our first D-Link level up for Stitch. The attack boost. Not that we really need that. <laughs> I'm only ex interested in the exceptionally rare. <laughs> We also never got Zack's uh, Hero's uh, Pride finisher, which is really, really, really good. So I think we should uh, remedy that realm. Hey. No, 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 I don't want to hit the big guy. No, I don't want to hit the big guy. <laughs> okay, stop hitting the one fat guy. You are literally only hitting that one fat guy who you can't damage. Wow. Good use of a dealer. Let's see if we can get stitched to max level. No gravity time. Why is my did was it counting down my dealing gauge? While that cutscene was playing? While that unskippable cutscene was playing? How dare you. Oh hey, stop, Garish's Max Level, so did Fundaga, and fire! Cool. This also means we can finally meld our last barrier with Stopaga. To get Stop- No, I got the 20% chance to get a second Time Splicer. I did not want Time Splicer, but I guess I have it now. Great, so now I need to get another Stopaga, level that up to Max Level, and try again. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's time Splicer's a really good command, but I wanted Stop Barrier. <laughs> Whatever. Hey, I'm Aqua. I saved the day. Why are you trying to shoot at me? Alright, I have a plan in this room. To get that power, to get that over there, we got a sliding dash and we got two fire dashes. We only needed one fire dash, though. 
Hachunk, zero Gravara. That's not great. I already have zero Gravara. I want something better. It's my treasure chest, and I want it now. Oh, yeah, we should also uh, start leveling up Prism Rain now. Hungry, hungry crystals. Mega Ether. And then... Junk. A mega attack recipe. Cool. How about our treasures now? Are we missing any? No, we got them all in deep space now. We did get them all in the Turo Transporter. How great. Oh boy. We get a shimmering crystal. That's not even the right place to put it. Apparently you have to put that in the middle of the screen. Otherwise it doesn't count. I know my favorite part of this is trying everywhere to put the guys down in the hopes that they get the shiny sparkly finisher. Darn it. Just a couple of points short of getting stop. Oh wait, we don't have to meld stop barrier. We get it for free. Oh, well then in that case, I'm actually quite happy to get another time splicer. <laughs> we can spam time splicer now endlessly once we get five attack hastes. That sounds really broken, but we can do it. Are there any commands for sale that we just don't have yet? Blizzard Edge it we don't have, so we'll buy one of those. Why do we have 27 arrows? I'll buy a Roga. Even though we've already gotten one before. I'll buy Blackout. We're also going to buy free Magneras. I've also decided to level them up in Olympus Coliseum because the enemies are a little bit easier to deal with here and they give almost as much CP. Especially once we get the Experience 6260 link to its maximum level. Oh look! Max level! Double CP! And we can do the Ohana beat one time just to add it to the reports. But otherwise... Hey, we unlocked Explosion for some reason. I don't know why, but we did. Homing Slide as it reaches max level, that's great. Explosion! Uh, no, I don't, I don't think it's gonna be Explosion. This is gonna be a Thermal Detonator. <laughs> otherwise, let's go back to Stupefy. Finish up our short walk. Oh, and one other thing, uh, we're switching back over to the random beam for 626 because I hate the Ohana beat. Also, we can show off our Prism Rain shot lock. Gotcha. Look how bright and colorful it is. Gotcha. And it deals pretty high damage, too. One other thing is that for Aqua, the Experiment 626 D-Link is slightly different. Because it actually has a new command in place. After Zero Gravaga, it has Fundaga Shot. Which basically, you fire Fundaga forward, and then it zaps other people that are nearby. That's an Aqua exclusive command, which is why uh, we can meld it for just Aqua, but that's why it doesn't appear for Terra or Vengeance. Oh wow, everything's max level now! Funny how this happens. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna meld my Fyragas with my Fyras to get more triple Fyragas. Oh look, it had Re Leaf Bracer. If only it gave me that for free earlier. Because honestly, triple Fyraga is just very, very nice to have. And it comes with HP Prize Plus for free. I didn't even equip anything on it and it just, it, gave, it gives it to me. Cool. I'm gonna meld Strike Raid with Fundaga, which gives us Fundaga Shot, which is the thing we just saw in the Experiment 626 dealing. All right, at this point, we need to start leveling up our Magneras because we need to start melding those in order to get something, uh, a couple of commands that are pretty good later down the line. Gonna buy three more Fundagas because the more Fundagas we have, the better. I need more money, so I'm gonna take advantage and sell most of my arrows. I'm gonna sell like 25 of them. Wow, that gives a lot. Funny how that happens when you sell, when you have way too many of one type of command. Similarly, I'm also going to sell most of my Blizzaras. Look at that! I got a couple thousand extra money. Isn't that wonderful? I will also buy just a Fundara. Because I'm going to need that as well. I'm going to level up our Fundara right away. 
because that's part of the secret ingredient soup that we need that we're making. All right, here we go. So now we're gonna meld our free commands that we needed for the Magneras for. So first up, we want Magnera plus Fundara. And to this, we'll attach an Abounding Crystal, and this gives us Money Magnet with Link Prize Plus. Next, we're going to meld a Magnera with a Cure, and we will attach a Wellspring Crystal to this. This gives us Energy Magnet with Combo Plus. Finally, we will meld our last Magnera with a Zero Gravera. To this, we will attach a Pulsing Crystal, and this gives us D-Link Magnet with Finish Boost. So these are all exclusive commands to Aqua. Money Magnet, use Magnetic Force to yank money right out of enemies. Energy Magnet, use Magnetic Force to yank HP prizes right out of enemies. And then you get Magnet, use Magnetic Force to yank D-Link prizes right out of enemies. They're not great, but I mean, I needed those commands, so here we are. Let's see, I'm also going to equip a Blazaga, because I kind of want to... If we go over to our finish commands, we head back to Oblivion. This requires us to enter the Diamond Dust command style a whole bunch of times, and we haven't done that even once, because we haven't been using Ice commands, and we've been just firewheeling our opponents to death over and over again. But this time, if we actually have a Blazaga with us, it should help us out a good bit. And honestly, we can just kind of keep repeating this. Just Blazaga, Diamond Dust, leave, come back. I'll also show off the different money magnet, dealing magic, energy magnet. If the fat guy would leave us alone, that is. Wow, it was very rude of you to interrupt. I'm trying to give a demonstration here. Wow. That. There we go. That at least gave us some HP prizes. Like I said, these these abilities really aren't that good. The penny bag isn't even working. Wow. Why would I ever want to use that? There we go. We unlock Ice Burst. An Aqua exclusive finish command. Which we can show off right now. Ice Burst. That's a cool looking one. <laughs> but obviously we can't keep it at that name. No, 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 no. We need something much better. Perform a spinning attack followed by a series of blizzard blasts. Yeah, yeah, it's great. But what if we named it... Santa's Revenge. <laughs> Santa's f giving coal. If you're naughty, Santa's got a special kind of revenge in store for you. Ho, ho, ho. I guess if we go back to Expecto Patrona, we could try getting the fall to low HP over and over again ability. Wow, we still haven't leveled up all our Fundagas yet. That was an example of teleport uh, screwing me over. I was trying to renewal block barrier that attack, but teleport's like, oh, move into the attack? You betcha. So there you go. That's an example of teleport and why it's terrible. We are not equipping that anymore. Oh, hey. Our air slide is max level. What do you mean we haven't gotten that at all? Yes, we have. I want to buy another air slide. Okay, that red hot chili pepper just swooped in out of nowhere with no advance warning. That's not supposed to happen. Did we at least start leveling that up? What the heck? Excuse me, I got several of those. Does it reset because I... I didn't do that in the other stories? What the heck? There we go. Now we unlock Teal Strike. Took us long enough. Keeping with the Harry Potter themed, we now have I Lived Snitch. <laughs> because if you snitch on me and try to kill me, uh, it's not going to because I have Heal Strike now. Man, we have a lot of the finish commands. This is great. There we go, look at all those max level commands. Yes, yes, yes. Now I'm just gonna do something to, you know, not, not a big deal, I'm just, you know, gonna level up. Uh, whoa, where did I get all these quick blitzes from? I thought I only bought three from the shop, but okay. Gonna level up these quick blitzes and so, like, you know, no, pretty pretty typical stuff. I'm not doing anything crazy, you know, it's just, it's very, very basic. Now, what the heck am I gonna do with all these quick blitzes and sliding dashes, I hear you wondering. Well, 
Never fear, because what we're going to do is we're going to just meld these together with a fleeting crystal to get attack haste strike rate, and we're going to do this three times to get our remaining attack hastes. Magnica bind wellspring crystal, we get mini with air combo plus. Magnet spiral zero gravica hungry crystal, transcendence with treasure magnet. Forgot to meld those. Well, look, our strike rates already are maxed out. We get all the attack hastes. Isn't this just wonderful? Binding Strike Wazaga gives us Deep Freeze. We never got the ice cream ingredients from Deep Space, and I think that we should remedy that before we end the video. Just spawn in the Turo Transporter and go to the Turo Prison Block. They should spawn in at the end of the room, just like they did for Terra. And there we go. And wow, obliterated. Aqua's magic stat is a wee bit high. In case you didn't know. Alright boys, we got ice cream ingredients for you. Thanks for the ingredients! Look, we made some ice cream! We get Fabricadabra! There we go, I've been waiting for that one. Fabricadabra. That's the one that lets you go into the Spellweaver command style whenever you want. And if you play a level 1 run, I recommend you get to come, become acquainted with the Fabricadabra. It uh, makes the level 1 run much easier but if i ever play a level one run of this on stream i'll show that off basically the finisher is absurdly powerful in a level one run anyhow that's gonna do it for today thanks for watching everybody next time we go to neverland oh wait hang on before we do and before i forget i can't believe i didn't do this i didn't equip the hyperdrive keyblade which gives me an extra one strength and it just looks cool well i've done that next time we go to neverland we uh finish up the last of the main worlds and then after that we really just have the end game and that is gonna be a lot of fun once the end game comes around so look forward to that next time thanks for watching and until we meet again my friends have a great day and god bless